What do you feel like the, the main um, issues people are having pop up now with being at home and sitting down all day long? Is there anything that you feel like they could alleviate that? I know it's a completely broad question, um, but like your, your top five. Uh, I'm going to tell you the, my top one for sure. And it goes right along with the certification you were talking about that I'm um, almost completed and will be launching pretty soon. It's a type two diabetes exercise specialist course. And one of those kind of comorbidities, complications, things like that is a sedentary lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And I mean, we look at smoking. We know that that's not good for us and uh, excessive drinking. We know that obesity has a lot to do with um, uh, risk factors and sedentary lifestyle. And the sedentary lifestyle, smoking and drinking are kind of the three factors that you look at that are highly dangerous that lead to multiple other issues. And when you hear the phrase sitting is the new smoking, so you've probably heard that before. And that's not true because I'm sitting right now and that's not like smoking. But if I sit here all day long, it almost is. So it's not sitting is the new smoking. It's sedentary behaviors is the new smoking. Right. It's a sedentary behavior that doesn't. In fact, sedentary behavior is so bad, Joey, that uh, you could work out for an hour at a, at a, a, a good regularly kind of intense or vigorous pop and then go sit all day and it not benefit you any really. Wow. So the sedentary lifestyle is a big issue and I see it. This is the worst part. I see it in my kids, right? Because they're going to school online. Mm -hmm. They they're doing their virtual school and they sit all day and then they, uh, they get on video games and they, we have to make them, you know, my, my parents are like, you got to go outside and get outside and play, just go outside. And, but that was cool. Cause I lived in Alabama and there was a backyard and we could go outside and play like New York city. Right. That's not the same. You don't just send your kids outside to go play. So uh, that's been, that's been a challenge. The sedentary behaviors, the sedentary lifestyle, this constant, constant, non-stop sitting. The amount of calories that you burn in exercise don't come anywhere close to the amount of calories that you burn in the day anyway. Right. And so what we're really looking at is we're not saying don't exercise. Exercise is highly indicated, highly valuable. The benefits of exercise are incredible, but not as incredible as getting up and moving regularly. Right. So just moving. And if you, if you don't have to sit, stand. And that's these studies about sedentary lifestyles are what prompted the walking desks in office and standing desks in offices because it's such powerful content that's coming out of the research about the adverse effects of sedentary behaviors. And employers employ sedentary behaviors. They put those behaviors out there and on people. And so now you see some of the employers trying to unpack that.